We really want to thank the school children of Illinois who helped prepare boxes of uh, holiday cards and Christmas cards for our service members, our wounded warriors who are in the American Military Hospital in Landstuhl, Germany. That's where I'm headed. I've been there, uh, this is my eighth time. Uh, every year we want to send from the people of Illinois uh, our, our salute to our soldiers who are wounded and, and recovering in the hospital. There are many other service members who are uh, working at the hospital, about 2,000 of our military men and women. And it's important at this time of year, important at this time of year when we have uh, folks who are away from home, who are wearing the uniform of our country, that we all say a profound uh, debt of thanks and gratitude to their service to our country and to our democracy. And uh, it's very important, I think, that we pray for the recovery of our soldiers who are wounded and who are recovering in the hospital. They get the very best medicine and trauma treatment in the whole world. Uh, this is done at a military hospital in Landschul, Germany, where all of the service members who are wounded are taken from Afghanistan first to the hospital there and then on to uh, Bethesda uh, Military Hospital in the United States or Brook Army Medical Center in the United States. But the people of Illinois, their hearts are good and true, and especially at this holiday time, we want to say thank you to those who are serving us. That's really the greatest thing about America, that we have so many volunteers. The heart of America, the heart of Illinois, is the heart of a volunteer. And we have uh, many volunteer uh, school children in Illinois who prepared these Christmas cards and holiday cards. We have so many people who volunteer to help our military men and women. We have a website, operationhomefront.org, the busiest website in all of state government. It gives specific ideas on how all of us on the home front could take good care of those who have borne the battle and who are bearing the battle. We have many, many uh, service members from Illinois, from the National Guard, from the reservists, as well as active duty, who are now serving in Afghanistan. They will not be home for Christmas or New Year's, uh, while we're enjoying the holidays, they have no holiday. They work full time, round the clock many times, in order to protect our democracy. So we want to say thank you. The best way to do it is, I think, find a way to serve uh, and help and support our troops. And we have plenty of ideas to do that. And one of them is uh, uh, reaching out at the holiday time and finding a way to, to help uh, support our troops.